Indians. In 1816, Shaka returned to the Zulu kingdom and seized power from his father. He immediately began to implement a series of reforms that transformed the Zulu military. He introduced new weapons and tactics, such as the short stabbing spear, Ikelwa, and the buffalo horn formation. He also created a system of military training that was based on discipline and obedience. Shaka's reign coincided with the start of the Mifakane Difakane, which refers to the widespread disruption and warfare in southern Africa during the early 19th century. Although Shaka preferred social and propagandistic political methods, he also engaged in battles. Under Shaka's leadership, the Zulu army became one of the most powerful forces in southern Africa.